and now we're going to go ahead and model the door for our car here and I'm basically just going to hide some of these pieces because they're somewhat in the way and we don't really need to see them um, as long as they're in the, the file we're okay and let's go ahead and model our door and I'm only going to do this once so I'm going to delete half of the model and then we'll just mirror it back over I'm going to edit these vertexes just a tiny bit so I have a little bit of rounded shape in our, uh, in our car door which I feel adds to the attitude of the car I'm just editing the vertexes just a little bit being careful not to go too much because I don't want to mess up the the base geometry of the car definitely want to be mindful of that anytime you edit a vertex make sure you look at what you're doing because you don't want to you know add yourself problems later on down the road I'm just going to go ahead and inset our door here being very careful of how much I actually inset because I don't want to go too far I'll definitely have to edit a, a few vertices here and right away that I can see that you know pressing 3 on the keyboard that that gives us a, a decent looking door and with that, in, it, that inset it's already going to maintain a, uh, a good amount of its shape for whenever we extract the door and you can see that I selected one too many faces there and we'll just go ahead and add the thickness to our our car for the door do the same thing for the actual door part of the car just extrude in and then extrude down or in and in again so that it's you know not overlapping on itself and that's giving us a, a pretty nice looking door I'm just double checking it to, to make sure that the shape is okay. And now we'll go ahead and bring that window over. And I'm just going to make sure I uh, double check the, the snapping of our, our vertices here so that everything's going to fit properly.
those Java updates. I apologize for that. As you can see, I just edited uh, the vertexes there and resnapped them just to make sure that they're going to fit properly. I'm going to duplicate that one window so that I can make the the metal piece and the rubber grommet again just have to simply delete the inside here move this back over so that we can have the metal part of our window just have to add an edge loop here and do a little bit of shape editing just have to add a couple extra edge loops here to make sure it's going to retain its shape. And these little details are really what, uh, what go ahead and actually sell your car to the viewer. And we'll go ahead and make our glass here. just try and make sure it's placed properly just going on the inside of the car there to make sure that it's going to fit properly. Having a little bit of smooth division there. And that's looking looking pretty good there. So now we're going to go ahead and mirror that over to the other side so now that we have both doors can simply separate the model and group it so that we have our doors in the right groups and I'll need to go ahead and merge the the body of our car here and merge the vertices and as you can see our car is uh, really starting to come along um, you know for right now it's it's looking pretty good um, 
still needs a decent amount of work and you know we're slowly making progress